Good morning. <clears throat> Good morning. This is Justin Schneider at the Herald Bulletin. It's Tuesday, August 25th, 2009. Today, more warm and dry weather, but that all ends on Wednesday when we're supposed to have rain, which may continue through the end of the work week. In the news today, the Herald Bulletin has gained unprecedented access into the Bright Automotive headquarters. I'll take you on a tour through the building in words and pictures, and we'll find out what's the latest on Bright's funding applications. Plus, more on the Senate Gaming Committee meetings. They're considering a smoking ban and the inclusion of table games at uh, Hoosier Park in Anderson and Indiana Live Casino in Shelbyville. Plus, construction has begun at Anderson Fire Department's Fire Rescue House. We'll bring you an update on the project. Look for all that and more in tomorrow's Herald Bulletin and online at theheraldbulletin.com. As I was saying, I've talked to you a lot about Legends of Anderson. That's the in-depth video interview that we did with Carl Erskine and Johnny Wilson. Well, a lot of the segments you find on our website now will start going private. Uh, but we will make a DVD available. It's a great idea for any baseball or basketball fan uh, in your life or if you know someone who just takes a lot of pride in Anderson Athletics. So that'll be available for 10 bucks. We'll have uh, all the information you need on our website starting today. Don't forget that as always, you can sign up for email headlines and text message news alerts by visiting our homepage and clicking on, wait for it, this. Have a great Tuesday. See you on Wednesday.